All right, guys, so now it is official. We are headed full steam towards a brand new Cell Saga campaign starting this upcoming weekly reset, which is going to be tomorrow night. Now, we got some major announcements here to break down. We're going to be breaking down this whole Cell Saga campaign, what we can expect, when we can expect it. But I also like to hear your comments down below. Uh, comment down below, who would you guys like to see for this Cell Saga campaign, whether it be the LF, Ultra, or both. So let's not waste any time, guys. Uh, we got a lot of stuff to cover here. By the way, I absolutely love this uh, title screen. This is probably my favorite title screen, honestly. Like, And I say that every time, but this one is just super, super clean. But let's not waste any time, guys. Let me just be quiet. Let's play this trailer really quick, and uh, let's break it down. Gonna leave a mark. I am super busy now. Final. I'm going to enjoy this. This ends now. All right, guys. So I don't know about you, but that trailer was extremely, extremely hype. Now, besides the fact that, of course, we're going to get a brand new free to play cell, first form cell to be exact, as well as the, uh, you know, brand new equipment for Super Vegeta Zenkai. So before we get to that, I just want to get to this final bit of the trailer, which literally says the final battle with, uh, with the fate of the world on the line. So it cuts off to this and it shows, of course, the LF perfect cell that we got a few months back right after the anniversary. And then it cuts off to Super Saiyan 2 Team Gohan. Now, I'm going to play this one more time without sound. And we're going to be breaking this down really, really quick. So, uh, correct me if I'm wrong in the comment section down below. But does this Super Saiyan 2 Team Gohan look quite different right here? Like, am I tripping or is there like rain? Like, was this, was this here before? Like this rainbow aura off his beam. Kind of like an ultra aura off his beam. I'm not sure if it was... Um, I haven't double checked. It probably was, to be honest. I'm, I'm probably reaching here, but still, uh, the fact that they cut this off to the end, um, I wouldn't be shocked whatsoever if we seen Ultra Super Saiyan 2 Team Gohan now. Of course, you know, we got Beast Gohan running amok right now in PvP, so this would be quite scary to, uh, you know, to build a Sun family or even a hybrids team off of, unless they make them the same color or something like that, but yeah, honestly, this is a, this is a really hype trailer. Now, we see a multitude of characters here in the beginning. If we just scroll up, oh, it's not keeping up with me. If we just scroll through this, oh, now it's just not loading. Anyways, we see a few androids, of course, uh, like Android 19, 20. Honestly, I wouldn't really mind some more Android buffs to build on top of Super 17. I think that would be pretty cool if we just check this out really quick. February 2024's episode campaign. So we see Trunks. We could possibly be seeing brand new Trunks. We see Andrew 19, of course, Dr. Jero, Andrew 20. Now, I wouldn't really mind a like duo or like trio assist unit of Dr. Jero um, and a couple androids. I think that would be pretty cool. Like, can you imagine Dr. Jero and then he, and then kind of like um, kind of like Jero, Trunks, and uh, Pen? They all come in and just help him out with with his like strike attacks, his blast attacks, and stuff like that. I think that would be pretty creative. And I think that would be a great transition from Super 17 as well as part of the campaign. Now, of course, we also see, um, you know, uh, with the title screen here, you know, we see Super Vegeta. And of course, he is going to be getting his unique equipment. I don't think it's going to be doing too much, honestly, guys. Um, yeah, I don't think these equipments do too much. They, I, I still think they got to make them much, much better to bring out something out of these extremely old units. Uh, but yeah, I, I don't think it's going to make much of a dent, sadly. Um, I would love to see, this is what I would like to see, okay, guys? I would love to see an LF Super Super Vegeta. So a final LF Final Flash Vegeta. I think, I think it's his time. 
I think it's well overdue for us to get not only a Final Flash Vegeta, but some love for a single Vegeta character in the game itself. Comment down below. Do you guys agree with me? Am I the only one that really wants a Final Flash Vegeta? I mean, this looks really, really cool. Just this image, right? I mean, this gif right here, right? Of him getting all pumped up. But um, but yeah, Final Flash Vegeta and then end it off perhaps with a Ultra Super Saiyan 2 Team Gohan. That to me would be absolutely epic. Now, if we just go back to the trailer really quick, and if we just see this right here, it says, get ready for loads of events and new characters based on Dragon Ball, um, you know, anime Cell Saga. So, and this obviously starts tomorrow for the weekly reset, which is what we expected pretty much, right? Um, now, if we just go back to the trailer really quick, we see Dr. Jiro. Uh, let me mute that. We see 17. We also see 18. So 16, I would love to see a brand new 16. We are well overdue for a 16. Honestly, like from the Cell Saga itself, we don't have a, we have this like extreme 16. Um, but yeah, we also have the Android Saga one, but he's not technically part of the Cell Saga itself. But I think we're overdue for a cool 16 character. I mean, I like Android 16, man. I think he was a pretty cool addition to the anime itself. The fact that he just kind of turned good as an Android. I don't know. I thought it was pretty cool. Here's like the main reason why Gohan transformed as well. Maybe like a uh, a Ultra Gohan where he transforms and there's like a cutscene of uh, 16's head getting smashed. That'd be pretty cool. Piccolo, of course. I, I love regen. I love Piccolo. Always nice to see. It would always be nice to see a brand new Piccolo. So it says here, a fierce fight with the menacing life form Cell. Don't know if we're going to get a, a new Cell besides the free-to-play Cell, honestly. And by the way, this scene right here is Vegeta's alternative artwork, which is pretty funny, actually. Actually, let me pull it up, just show you guys. It's exactly this exact same artwork. See, look, check this out. So it's like, this is um, Zenkai Yellow's Super Vegeta's alternative artwork, and then this is the screen. So it's pretty much the exact same thing, which is pretty funny, right? Boom, boom. Um, so yeah, I mean, Super Vegeta is something I definitely want to see, but I don't think we're going to be seeing any more cells uh, because we, I, I think the old, perfect, or not the old, but the latest perfect form cell that we got, the LF, the good one, right? Um, he's going to be making a comeback in this campaign, obviously. That's why they didn't bring him back in the Android banner because number one, that would be a broken, broken banner, but then nobody would really want to summon for this. So I get their marketing move behind that. Um, so yeah, a LF Super Vegeta, a Trunks of some sort. Hercule would be pretty funny to see. Of course, you know, we got Cell Jr. there. We got an Extreme Cell Jr. not too long ago. Oh, okay. So this is something I would love to see. Um, I saw that Cell right there. This Revival, Perfect Form Cell, if he gets a Zenkai, dude, I would absolutely, I would love it. The two characters I really want to get Zenkai'd in this whole campaign is this red transforming, um, you know, Revival, Perfect Form Cell. This one right here, as well as the Instant Transmission Goku. These two characters are like the main ones. And if you even want to toss in a third one, I would say Heat Dome Trunks because I really like just Heat Dome, like the attack in itself. So yeah, man, I mean, I'm very excited for this campaign. Looks very promising. I love the title screen. Uh, we're we're going to get a first form cell, free to play, of course. Um, you know, uh, unique equipment for a Super Vegeta. And perhaps maybe a brand new Ultra Super Saiyan 2 Team Gohan. So a lot of exciting stuff, guys. Comment down below your thoughts of what we're going to get or what would you guys like to personally see yourselves. But that's going to wrap it up. I'll definitely catch you guys once again tomorrow morning for another video. Catch you guys then. Have a good one. Peace.